hey everyone welcome or welcome back to my channel my name is kelly i hope you stay <laughs> welcome or welcome back to my channel if you are a returning subscriber welcome back thank you so so much for clicking on another one of my videos i'm super excited to have you here and if you are a new subscriber or a new viewer welcome my name is kelly i hope you decide to stay on this channel i love to do videos on fragrances body care everything smell good look good and feel good so if that is something that you're interested in please consider subscribing and clicking the notification bell down below so that you never miss any of my uploads and in today's video you guys i have for you something exciting it's not going to be a very very long video but it is going to be a good video what i have for you guys is an amazon perfume dupes haul so i was scrolling on amazon just trying to look at fragrances because that is what i do um obsessed with perfumes and everything so i'm always looking on websites for fragrances window shopping adding things to my cart that i want to try i was doing the same thing on amazon i was so curious and i typed in perfumes under ten dollars or under 20 i think up under 20 or under ten dollars for women and then boom these popped up and i was like what there actually are fragrances on amazon under ten dollars like that's crazy and i was like what what is that i seen them for seven dollars and 49 cents i believe and i was like what seven dollars and 49 cents for fragrances when i clicked on it i seen that they say inspired by fragrances so i seen some that said inspired by um angel by moon glare and livia's bell and cashmere mist and like euphoria by calvin klein and a bunch of like inspired by fragrances and i was like what i've never seen this brand i've never heard of this brand so i was so curious and my curiosity took over me and i ordered some you guys i ordered three of these inspired by fragrances from this brand called in style this is what it looks like it literally looks the packaging just looks like a medicine or like type of like cream ointment cream type packaging but i was just so curious so i ordered them and i was like i'm just going to test them out on video for you guys and tell you guys if it's good or not in case you guys stumble upon these if they're good so you guys can get them and if they're not good so that you don't have to spend your coin so i spent my coin for you so that you don't have to plus we're gonna have fun because we're gonna see we're gonna sniff some fragrances and see if they're good or not so i have three here the first one that i have is an inspired by lancome's lavia's bell seven dollars you guys inspired by lancome lavia's bell so let's see about that and then i have inspired by theory mugler's angel which i know is a very popular fragrance i'm a alien type of girl not a angel type of girl but i got it to test it out and then the last one that i have is you guys not gonna believe me is inspired by black opium by ysl i was like what can you really like can you really dupe why sell black opium Livia's bell and angel can you so let's see you guys let's start with Livia's bell because i'm curious and you guys know Livia's bell is so good it's so strong it's so beautiful love that fragrance so let's see how it compares the bottles are very very basic looking like i remember my grandma having a bottle that looked like this a fragrance that she probably bought from like the pharmacy or something when i was probably like six years old so it's a very very just simple packaging so yeah this one is the lavia's bell dupe let's try it out It smells really nice. 
it smells like Livia's Bell, but not 100%. It doesn't smell 100% like Livia's Bell. I get that burst of sweetness that Livia's Bell has, but this is, I feel like it's missing the, like that black currant and the tonka bean. But let's see when it dries. And I also have to see how it is on the skin, but it gave me that burst of sweetness that Livia's Bell has, like, it does have like a Livia Spell scent, like kind of creamy, sweet, dark, but this has something in it that almost smells like vanilla bubblegum. It does. Like the first spray, it did smell like Livia's Bell. Like if you spray it in a room, people will probably think that you are spraying Livia's Bell, but now that it's drying down, it doesn't smell like Livia's Bell. For real, it smell it still has the initial scent, but very, very light. And I just get sweetness, like um praline sweetness, and like a bubblegummy smell, like vanilla bubblegum with praline. And I just don't get any of that like deepness that Lavia Spell has with the you know black currant and the tonka bean and the vanilla type scent it smells like vanilla bubblegum and praline and in the background lavia's bell so i gotta see how this smells on my skin i will do an update for you guys next week so I'm not gonna leave you guys hanging on this. I'm gonna try it on my skin and see. I'm nervous to try it on my skin. I feel like this would go really good with like a bubblegum fragrance mist, oddly. It smells like vanilla bubblegum and praline. Upon the first spray, it smells like Livia's Bell. Now it smells like Livia's Bell, great, 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 great aunt or something. I don't know. Doesn't smell like Livia's Bell for real. It has that little Livia's Bell like essence, I would say, like in the background, but not really. It smells sweet, like praline and like vanilla bubblegum, if that's even a thing. But yeah, not too bad, but definitely not Livia's Bell. Definitely not. I'm gonna try these out, you guys, this week. And I'm gonna make a video next week and tell you guys if i kept them or if i decluttered them returned them what did i do with them or if i kept them because they were okay or what because even if they perform like body mist i feel like that's fine you know but they have to smell good so let's move on to the angel one inspired by the airy mugler's angel fragrance and i've only smelled angel at the store like sniffed a tester strip at the store and also from a little sample but i don't have that fragrance because i remember me not liking it but i know a lot of people like this one so i wanted to try it out and see what i thought let's see and by the way that love is Oh no. Mm mm. Uh uh. I don't even have to put this up. This gave me instant headache. <laughs> what? Why did I spray that? Uh uh. Immediately no. Immediately no. What is this? This smells so bad. This smells, ugh, this is making me nauseous. It smells like star anise. I think that's how you say it in English, but estrellita de anise. I know that my parents always made us tea with that. It smells like, it smells like that, like a very strong star anise scent and like licorice or something. And it's so cloying and so strong and obnoxious and just bad. It just smells like star anise and powder. 
and like licorice. Hopefully it fades away <laughs> from the air, but oh, it's a no for me. Immediately no. I regret spraying that so much, okay, guys. So pray for me. Hopefully this one's good. I already have a headache, so this one is the Inspired by Black Opium. So let's see, you guys. We have nothing to lose at this point. Let's do two sprays. Probably too much. I probably should have just did one. But mmm. Okay. It smells good. It smells like sweet florals. Doesn't smell like black opium, but I see why. Like I see what they were trying to do, but it doesn't smell like black opium per se. Like in the first sniff like the first spray no it doesn't it actually it actually doesn't smell bad it smells good it smells creamy like creamy vanilla a little bit ambery i do smell the alcohol still even though it's been sprayed like a whole minute ago but it smells good it doesn't smell bad it smells it smells nice. I think this one smells even nicer than the Olivia's Bell one. I think this one is the best one out of the three. It smells nice and like tonic, a little bit floral. I don't know, like a yellow floral fragrance. Sweet. Kind of like tonic, but not too much. It has like the perfect amount of like freshness and sweetness, like creamy sweetness to it. It's not bad. It is not black opium but it this would be like a black opium body mist let's put it like that you know that the body mists are very light and they smell like the essence of the perfume like not like the actual fragrance so this would be like a black opium body mist not bad this one's not bad this one's good i think i'll keep this one and layer it with something because it's not bad yeah it's more floral than like creamy like tonic like black opium not so much of that coffee and stuff like black opium but i kind of see what they were trying to do like this would be like a black opium body mist nothing crazy I might keep it and use it to layer. I don't know yet, but it doesn't smell bad. It smells good. It smells good. The smell of this one, of this angel one, is still in the air and I feel nauseous. Like this one is so bad. Like if you literally want to walk around smelling like star anise and like licorice and like powder, like face powder, then you probably would love this, honestly. Honestly. Because this is so strong and like very very obnoxious smelling i do not like it all right you guys so that is everything that i have for you in today's video i hope that you enjoyed even a little bit i would say that the best one was the black opium one it is like a black opium body mist the lancome Livia's bell dupe one is not really giving Livia's bell and that angel one i feel like even though i don't like the angel um scent this is 10 times worse than that angel one like literally smells so strong like an herbally like literally like star anise and like licorice so like obnoxious but anyways you guys I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know your thoughts down below. Let me know if you've seen this brand before. And if you have tried it, let me know which one is actually really good. Um, the brand is called In Style. I got it from Amazon. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to give me a thumbs up. It really does help. Leave me a comment down below. And don't forget to subscribe if you're not already subscribed. And I will see you guys in my next video. What's a good to do? She needs love, she tells me love too Girls can't ever say we want it Girls can't ever say yeah Girls can't ever say we